In this Insight tutorial video I'm going to show you how to add devices to the Disable All Plant Outputs function button that it can be found in the Tactics' Disablement menu. So effectively when you press that button the Disable All Plant Outputs these devices would also be disabled when you press that. So to do that we simply need to find the device that we want or the outputs that we want to be disabled. Let's say loop 2, this module here. Let's say these last three relays, we want them to be isolated because they're handling the air handling units or the um, mechanical shutdown boards. So we double click on one of them. We go to the disablement tab along here and say plant control output. When we go to the next one same thing, tick the box and save and the next one and tick the boxes. And the same is true for any other relay where it, wherever it's located. So let's say there's also some relays on the panel themselves, maybe going to an OWIS system, maybe one of these relays. We could double click on there, go to disablements and tick them boxes also. And that's how we add outputs to a function button that's in the disablement menu of the Tactics for the Disable All Plant Outputs. For further information relating to the Insight product range, don't forget to check out the website at www.insightfire.com.au.